Um, hope you guys are doing well today. Um, if I was to title this um, sermon, it would be called This is Love. Um, when I when I was sleeping today, uh, the Lord kind of reminded me of this uh, secular song by Amanda Marshall. And he, he said um, that this is how he feels about you today. Um, and it, he kind of gave it to me as um, a conversation between you, us, and him at this time. So I'm going to sing it and then talk for about 10 minutes about um, what I, what he's given me. So it goes like this. It's called Trust Me by Amanda Marshall. But this is what the Lord is saying. He's saying first, the first part would be us. The first part says, Look at this mountain. So many heartaches won. I can't help but wonder where's the other side. I've got to be honest. I've got, I've had my doubts. These tears are asking me. What's this got to do with love? Children, I'll tell you something to help you through this long, dark night. When this trouble passes over, you and I will walk away Knowing that our love survived Another test of faith You and I will walk on water The river of this will rise above And may not look that way but trust me, baby, children, this is love. Love is amazing. I'm torn, I confess. When a heart is uncertain, it's bound to second guess. This love won't forsake us. So dry your tears, I promise you that when this trouble passes over, you and I can walk, will walk away, knowing that our love survived another test of faith. You and I can walk on water The river rises will rise above It may not look that way right now But trust me children, this is love Here for you children There's nothing I want more our day's coming when we'll reach that peaceful shore. When this trouble passes over, you and I will walk away, knowing that our love survived another test of faith. Oh yeah, you and I will walk on water at the river rises.
still rise up and made up that we right now. But trust me, children, this is love. One more mountain, hey, so what? Trust me, children, this is love. That's the song. And as he brought it to me, he said that could be love on many levels. It could be romantic love. It could be uh, love when it comes to uh, family love or, or husband and wife, um, fiance, friends. He said, love is not love until it's been tested. I'll say that he said, love is not love until it's been testing, tested. This coronavirus is testing love on many levels. It's testing love on the marriage level. Um, it's testing love on the family level. It's testing love on the community level. It's testing love on the world level. Um, I, I was listening to, uh, I think it was Rich Wilkerson the other day, and he said that he was reading something that in China, uh, since the quarantine ended over there, the divorce rate has skyrocketed because um, when you're, you get on each other's nerves when you're, when you're together all the time, and he said, this is a time for testing on love, with love on all levels. It's a testing of, of not his love for us, but our love for him and our love for each other on so many different levels. And he's saying, trust me. My love for you is great. And when you come out of this, you'll see that this is love. Not, not the way that people are dying and whatever, but what we'll get from it. We'll, we'll get a greater understanding of his love for us. And on a human level, our love for our family, our love for our community, our love for our world will, will come out greater. And he wants us to come out greater with this thing, with this coronavirus. And he's saying, trust me, this is love. This is a testing of your love for your husband and your love for your kids. It, um, it's easy to say I love you, but it's harder to prove that you love a love, um, person. So he's saying, you say you love that person. Well, then I want you to prove it now. He's saying, this is a time when you're stuck in the house with the, with the ones closest to you and the ones you say you love. This is your time to prove it in whatever way he will, he will ask you to prove it. And this is a testing of faith, of family, of everything we hold dear. Because we can say everything. We can say, God, you're first. God, we love you. But this is the time he's saying, prove it. He's saying, I'm... He said, saying, I'm taking you through this so you can perfect your love to me and so it can grow stronger. There's nothing like a test on any level to make love on any level grow stronger. When, when tests happen, you understand how durable your love is. You understand how, how, what stuff your love is made of on any level. So, 
he's now asking us what stuff is your love for me your love for your family your love for your community is what stuff is it made of and that is the question that he's asking us today what stuff is your love made of and how can you make it better how can you make it more durable if it's weak how can you strengthen it number one is the word of god number two is your communication with your family and your friends and your communication with god how can you love someone and not communicate with them it's so funny now now that when people were busy before before quarantine they didn't have to communicate but being alone in the house together you have to communicate with each other and you see the gaps in your relationship in coronavirus coronavirus has forced us to see the gaps in our government the gaps in our relationship the gaps in our community and the gaps in ourselves and the question is now how do we fill those gaps and how do we um, make them durable and strong enough to last and to endure all these trials coronavirus has taught us so much as a, as a world and i pray that these are lessons that we take with us as individuals as a society as a government and as a world Okay, guys, I'll see you later. Bye. When this trouble passes over, you and I will walk away. Knowing that our love survived another test of faith. Yeah, yeah, you and I. Can walk on water if the river rises, the rise and fall. It may not look that way right now, but trust me, children, this is love. Bye, guys. See you later. I may come on tomorrow, Saturday, but I will definitely be on YouTube on Sunday for story time Sunday hopefully live this week but we'll see how it goes whether live or not I will be on at some point on Sunday hopefully before that if the Lord has something to say through me where he flows I go Bye. Come in, baby, this is love.